I was eight years old when I was first in care. Sometime later, I was sent back home after my father was wrongly being a suitable parent. When I was 14 years old, after being raped and abused, I put myself in foster care system. I was seeking refuge from a life of trauma and neglect that I was experiencing at home. The foster care system did save my life. It gave me a roof over my head, a bed, and meals. Yet I never found permanency. I never found parents. I never found a home. I was presented with the opportunity to be adopted by my mentor, who happened to be lesbian. She researched the possibility of what adoption would entail, yet was discouraged because of the negative stigma surrounding the LGBT community. Words cannot describe how much I would have loved to have had two loving mothers or two loving fathers to guide me, protect me, and allow me to heal over being bounced around from home to home without having found a family. We need to encourage LGBT individuals and couples to adopt in order to provide more foster youth with permanency, a support system, a sense of belonging, a stable self-identity, to improve the outcome of their lives. A study by the Williams Institute found that there are more than 8.2 million LGBT identified adults in the US. Same-sex couples raising adopt raising children are also four times more likely than their different sex counterparts to be raising an adopted child. A commonly voiced concern against allowing adoption by lesbian and gay individuals and couples is that children growing up in those households will experience developmental and adjustment issues. There is no evidence to support such a concern. The American Academy of Pediatrics found that children who grow up with one or two and gay and or lesbian parents fare as well in emotional, cognitive, social, and sexual functioning as do children with heterosexual parents. Children's optimal development seems to be influenced more by the nature of the relationships and interactions within the family unit than by the particular structural form it takes. We need to prohibit any adoption or foster care agency, exempting faith-based agencies that receive federal funding from discriminating against LGBT individuals and couples as adoptive or fostering parents. And we need to provide funding for adoption and foster care agencies to develop training and recruitment campaigns that target prospective adoptive parents from the LGBT community. A University of Maryland study found that in states that prohibited adoption by gay and lesbian individuals and couples, there was a significantly larger proportion of children lingering in foster care and waiting for adoption. Like myself, <coughs> There are many youth who want and benefit from having parents, even if they happen to be gay or lesbian. Every child should have a family. Every child should have a place to call home. Thank you.